What's up, pussy lips? I'm McStud. <laughs> this is McStud. What? Pussy lips. Pussy lips. Ugh, it's not something you hear every day. You don't just only, go to. Only with you. You're not just walking to Walmart and be like, hey, let's get a look, fresh pussy lips on sale. Two for a pound. Two pounds for a dollar. <laughs> we're not in. <laughs> we're not. What's that, Europe? They use pounds? Yeah. Yeah, two for a pound. See, I, was, I almost made sense of that. <laughs> Unintentionally not making sense. Fuck. <laughs> I don't know how much. A, I don't know how. A, I don't know how much a pound is in American uh, currency. I don't know how much stone is. I don't know what that was a euro. Well, I don't know either. I don't know how much a stone is in like a weight, like that metric. I don't know. I weigh twelve stone. <laughs> I had a kidney stone. Is that a weight? No. Over there, like ah. I weigh kidney stone. Or, uh, I'm two tonsil stone. Malt liquor. Happy malt liquor Sunday, bitches. Oh, God. Sorry I'm a little weak. I spent last evening putting together my first ever basketball goal. Ever. Never, never attempted that. Really, really wore me out. <laughs> and then, uh, the, the fucked up thing is when you're putting the rim on, like there's a little U-shaped bolt and then there's the bottom bolts and it doesn't tell you to just like stop at a certain point. So you're just like, well, I guess it's tight enough. Then you put the goal up the rims like. It wasn't super bad though. It was pretty bad. <laughs> like it wasn't major, but it was like, <laughs> it was a good two inches from the back of the oh, rim. Oh, I like two there. inches. I bet you do. I give you the best two inches of your life. He, Malt liquor. You don't have two inches. I know. I got like an inch and a quarter. <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> I mean, for fuck's sake. Oof. Uh, so, uh, this might be a little old news, but it's new for us. I know a lot of kids in the past couple weeks have been going back to school. The back to school motion has finally hit us, personally. Well, my kids went back last week, I believe. And now uh, our kids go back, but they're doing virtual learning. And that's a big pile of doo-doo. I'm going to like all this zoom meeting shit like i'm in for a fucking trip tomorrow i'll be like uh we'll get you started email your teacher real fast so hey, i'm trying to get in right now i'm here i'm just not in the video <laughs> but did you hear my mom tell lexus what don't do embarrassing things they might be on camera oh god what was it a few months ago a couple months ago after the whole quarantine thing started with covid there was like a business zoom meeting mm -hmm. and one dude said he got off but his video was still on he goes and grabs lotion and shit and then he actually starts jerking off to porn and everyone's like oh my god he didn't realize he's still on it <laughs> <laughs> one dude's like i think he's jerking off or something like that if i remember correctly and they're like oh my god stop they're trying to yell his name out that'd be our kids I'm like what are you where, where are you taking the chrome back i gotta pee uh you got your shit so off yeah it's fine <laughs> No, oh, this is going to be a whole fucking mess. Bunch of kids that aren't used to Zoom meeting bullshit, trying it for the first time ever. <sighs> I can only Good imagine that. Uh, this is going to be a very interesting first week. You can't drink at noon. I don't. You have to pick me up. I don't. <laughs> oh, like I'm going to need a drink by yes. eight. It's eight o'clock and I already need the drink. I'm not home yet. <laughs> Anxiety. <laughs> <laughs> Can I drink yet? Tuesday morning, I wake up, my whole head's gray. I look like fucking Santa Claus. I'm like, what the fuck happened to you? E learning. <laughs> Virtual learning. It's hell. <laughs> Sorry. And the problem with that is, I'm gonna be, you know, I'm, I'm trying to make sure you're both doing the things. And anyone that knows this household, is sometimes I walk around just farting. And I'm not gonna remember that they're in their or Zoom meeting. Or scream inappropriate things. Oh, that's going to be a tough one, too. Jesus. This is going to be equally as challenging for me as it is the kids. Like, I want to fucking... I'm going to email and be like, Alexis has been kicked off Zoomies for the remainder of the year. I'm going to drop some, like... Inappropriate words. Like, that'll be in the middle of fucking classwork. I'm like, fuck! Chad! <laughs> I want to go to... Sorry! They might, hopefully they can mute themselves in the Zoom meeting. Sorry. Zoom meeting at, like, my job, I mute myself. Because you never know what's going to come out of my mouth either. Oh, 
And then if I need to say something, I can unmute myself, say what I need to say, and then mute it back. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, I can just like walk and do. Jack. <laughs> <laughs> My bad. <laughs> Tell them it was a door. I opened the garage door. And then all these kids will start giggling. <laughs> it's bad enough when you got kids in your own classroom farting and everyone starts cracking up. When you're trying to do Zoom virtual learning and the parent is like, <laughs> and they probably know which house it came from. <laughs> mm -hmm. Like, because it tells you who's talking. Oh my god. Like Alexis is talking and all you hear is that noise. Oh, and then the fucking zoom E is going on. There'd be like a, I'll drop something. Buster will think it's a, someone not going. <laughs> they is, probably will have a mute it themselves. It's going to be a whole fucking train wreck. <laughs> Somebody's got a case of the Mondays real bad. <laughs> Or they'll try to show me something or learn. I'm like, what the fuck is... Why am I doing me? I'm like... <laughs> I don't understand that. <laughs> <laughs> oh. So make Stud start school tomorrow, too. Yeah. <laughs> Pretty much. Oof. <laughs> Guess I better break out the Speedo and my sports bra. Mixed that on its first day of school. Maybe you should dress in that little outfit. My little first day of school With outfit. With your outfit and your backpack. I thought about, man, there. I thought about this this week. It's just been so busy with work and everything that just being home was. I don't know. Walk out there when they're starting school. Oh, God. Like, come home, walk out there. Are you ready for school? Yes. Should I go out by the corner and wait for the bus? Oh, God. Actually, they, that bus will already come and gone by the time we get back. Oh, yeah. <laughs> She's like, what the fuck is this? I'm like, my little McStud shorts. <laughs> I'm trying to go to school, missus. Like, you're like 40. Don't assume my age. Can't assume no, nothing. I got eighth grade coming up. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, the next thing, you'll be getting a phone call from that. I don't know who was outside your house trying to get to the school bus, but it was creepy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's just my husband. I'm not even going to answer the school calls at the moment. Oh, like, you need to call her stepdad. He's at home. I'm busy. I'm, I'm Zoom <laughs> I'm Zoom learning. <laughs> Whatever the fuck you call it. Zoom meeting. Lord Jesus. I think there's going to be a few different apps. Oh. But the good thing is they also can download that on their phone as well. Mm. Zoom meeting. No. I'd go to me. Zoom meeting, I can't download That's my That's bad news. I'm going to be back and forth with Snapchat and Zoom meeting. <coughs> <coughs> Hang on, I'll be right back. I got to pee. <laughs> oh, I'm back. <laughs> I'm going to be the constant battle between Snapchat and school. Oh. Uh. Yes. Uh. I might be ready for that. My maker's mark. <laughs> Sorry, babe. Can you find your own way home? You'll be like me that one day. Go ahead and download the Uber app. <clears throat> Why? I ain't gonna make it. Was that you had to pick up? Oh, no. It was our roommate. Yeah. Well, I was drunk as fuck. Yeah. It was new. Yeah. <laughs> uh. I was just having a bad day. <laughs> Lord Jesus. You didn't have to pick up anyone, did you? Yeah, I did. Oh, did you? I had to send one of my friends to go pick him up. Oh. Oh, yeah. Is that the lawnmower day? Yes. Oh, my God. I'm at work. And she's off. And it was like noon, 11, something. She sends me a picture. She already drinking. <sighs> <laughs> By the time I get home, she's pissed, cause of, p p pissed because the lawnmower won't start. You weren't doing it right. It was like a whole fucking mess. You're like, really? I've been trying it for hours. And we had to go see a house. Oh, we had to go to see a house. house. I'm like, oh, Lord. <laughs> and you didn't have like e-learning at that point. Nope. <laughs> it was just Owen trying to start the lawnmower. Oof. I think I had been fired though. Oh yeah, that's why you were home, wasn't it? Yeah. Oh, because that was that, that one bitch that called you on your night off. Yeah. From BC Forward. I had been fired and I was like the day before is like my second day home and I was trying to get shit done. Nothing was fucking working. So well, what did I do? Start drinking. Fuck that thing, and she was fired because it was like, it, it was after hours. 
And she gets a shitty call from her supervisor. And she got, you got shitty with it, didn't you? Yeah, I did. Then she had to go back in, and then next thing I know, because I was taking you to work then, too, and like, babe, come get me. They fucking let me go, and I go, okay. Well, you know, I sit in there and told Bob, it's the same fucking thing. I already know. The joy of living with this mix, dad. She don't put away shit from nobody. She's like, well, why'd you hang up on your supervisor? Uh, bitch, probably because it was fucking 8 p.m., and I don't work at 8 p.m. Were y'all paying you? No, he's still gonna pay for that 8 no. p.m. call. Ugh. Why? Right, because I don't have to fucking talk to her after hours. Thank you very much. Why'd I hang up on her? Yeah, like at any job, like most employees, are like, oh my god, the supervisor's coming in. Someone's coming in. You're like, oh my god, straight up. And this like, fuck it. <laughs> Who the fuck are they? Okay. That's what I told my supervisor. She's like, state's here. I was like, oh great, state's here. So let's have people start painting because we look like complete fucking retards. Mm hmm. This is true. They really were starting to paint the fucking doors and shit. And oh like, my god. Why? State. Oh, state's here. So now we can have wet paint everywhere. So they know we did that just because they're here. Oh, yeah, we had it at the prison, too. They did like, <laughs> call on the, the detail workers out yeah. of the housing use the sanitation so they can go start scrubbing floors and doing all this crazy shit. I'm like, what the fuck's going on? Oh, state's here. This looks stupid. Yeah. Like, what does. the fuck? Like, be on your A game. Like, okay. I'm like that every day. Should we be on our A game every day since yeah, we work with like, a bunch of fucking offenders? Yeah, like, that, that, <laughs> uh, I, that just made me want to do like some kind of stupid prank. Oh, I loved pranking the housing units, like on the opposite end of the walk. <laughs> like, hey, can you meet me out there? I'm in this unit. Okay, and I call the other one. Like, hey, can you out here with this in this unit? And they got some bullshit that didn't even. Neither of me. They walked out there like, you could see. Like, and they walked back pissed off. So they both had to walk. They're a bunch of lazy fucks anyway. Because I don't like to fucking walk anywhere. I had some really lazy staff there. And that's the ones I fuck with because they didn't want to fucking get off to do their regular checks and shakedowns, all kinds of bullshit. It's like, ah, I'm gonna make this one for a walk down the walk. I'm like, oh yeah, I get you that paperwork because sometimes you're out of paperwork and you got to go to another unit to get it. Yeah. So yeah, I utilize that to my full advantage. Checkpoint B. Oh God. <laughs> then we just be sitting there watching it. Here comes one, here comes the other. They get down there, they're like, what? They both think they need something or taking something over. Like, I don't, like, I thought you needed this. Well, I thought you needed that. And like, you see them throw their hands up in the air and they go. <laughs> <Jeez. laughs> <clears throat> I have some interesting drama at my second job, though, like that. Yeah. <laughs> Oof. This is true. And I didn't even work today. Yeah. I didn't even realize it. Mr. McStead got some really good sleep, though, last night. I did. Like, we, we'd actually, I, I, so since we got this new TV for me to use, <clears throat> we both have iPhones, and we realized that it, app, it utilizes Apple AirPlay. <clears throat> UFC 252 was on last night. Like, gotta find a link. I found a link. It only got sketchy here and there. A couple times. You gotta watch the whole fucking UFC 252. And it was amazing. Like we bought. Amazing it. quality. Like it looked like we <clears throat> paid for the pay per view. I'm like, holy fuck! I was really impressed. Other than the skipping here and there. But it was nice. And soon after that, Mr. Stud went to bed. Barely. Like, I barely. Yeah, I don't you barely know made I it. I hear him announce, or the, they announced it, but I don't know if I heard yeah, them Yeah, Stipe won, and that's when uh, Cormier said, because they both eye poked each other, but Cormier said he couldn't see in the fourth and fifth rounds. Oh, yeah, I heard that. Um, and then he said afterwards he could only see, like, black. Yeah, he, he's, he's retired now. Um, but it was a good night of fights, really. Good. I mean, it wasn't bad. Not bad for a pay per view, but I just wanted to see Stipe. But then I slept until two fifteen. Mm -hmm. So I slept like fourteen hours. So when that ends, a little after twelve, twelve thirty, yeah. something like that. That's for said I went straight to bed, and I fully expected her to sleep. I didn't want her to stay up. She had been exhausted. She fought with herself to watch the whole UFC. And we didn't get watched prelims. We just watched the main card, mm -hmm. and uh, <clears throat> I went to bed about three three thirty. I did dishes and shit, and then. Thinking I'd be up way before that. No, I slept about 12 hours myself. <laughs> I you almost slept longer than me. I did. I slept 14 and hours. And I went to bed after you did. I went to bed shortly after 2 and I woke, or midnight, and I went to woke up about 2.15. So I think I slept about 14 hours. Yeah, and this is like, and 
she only gets like one day a week to sleep in. Like she busts her balls day in and day out. I get Sundays. And I, I, I get naps throughout the week. This week's going to be rough. I've been like struggling this past week just sleeping. But now we got school. Fuck me. I'll put the black destroyer in my ass right now with the vapor rub on it. Better you than me, sorry. Oh, thanks. <sighs> Lord Jesus. I don't have to do a shit I can't. Like, you really can't help. Like, you don't have much time to fucking do anything. And I'm like, I can help a lot of shit. Some shit, I'm like, <clears throat> oof. But I said you, that you guys need to try to attempt everything uh -huh. and then I can drop it in check. But at night, I can't really spend the. I mean, all I have really is about kind of is, is minutes. what it is. We can do the best we can <clears throat> day in and day out. And that's all we can do. I have Thursdays and Fridays mm -hmm. off, and then Saturdays been a bitch. Mm -hmm. And Sundays, I have all the way off, but I refuse to do homework every fucking day. I don't, like, there's no reason to. Really. We have help we can do, but stuff that's just blatantly bullshit like we've had before because of laziness that's we can't have that <laughs> like, no you gotta put that work in this time <clears throat> and then we can do what we can to assist with shit but some of that that english shit oh my god those magic lenses shoot me in the goddamn anyways really uh guess who has high blood pressure you i, I have high blood pressure that was my 9 p.m. alarm, but I didn't realize what time it was. <clears throat> so, you took that last night, too. I did. Remember, because uh, you had that cold 45 that you had one drink? He's always got to be kept on track. <sighs> I'm really the one who's kept on track. I did. All right, we both kind of need that sometimes. <laughs> All right, there's my blood pressure medicine on film. Yes, blood pressure. The only reason I have high blood pressure is because she stresses me the fuck out day in and day out. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> I ain't even home long enough to stress your ass out. I can't even lie. <laughs> there ain't no way in hell. Mm. You know what stresses me out? <clears throat> Not being able to suck on these succulent nipples. What? Are you done? I want mother's milk. I'm nursing. I think our TV is taking over. <sighs> but I don't have mother's milk either. You do have mother's milk. Mm -mm. Oh, I thought you were about to pull your shirt up. I kind of low key got excited. <laughs> low key. I know. Low key. <laughs> like, I knew you weren't going to, but I was like, oh, like, the sense I was like. I just usually whip it out my arm sleeve. I don't want to do that. But this is your shirt, and it's not big enough. Yeah. <laughs> 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 oh, Miss McStuddle. Mix. I was trying to say Miss McStud's subtle nip slips, but I said Miss McStuddles. <laughs> ah, yeah, she likes this. Like, hey, Mark. <laughs> well, you have my full blown attention now. <laughs> what can I do to help you, Miss McStud? <laughs> There's a titty. I do that every once in a while. I love your titties. She won't let me lick her a butthole nipple. That's disgusting. What the fuck's a butthole nipple? I don't know. It's probably a wart or something. Ew. I don't want to lick your butthole wart. You're nasty. What? Completely nasty. You don't have a butthole wart? No. Can, can, we, use some, can we use some silly putty? Eef. Pretend one's there. <laughs> I, here's a fucked up thing. I wonder if anyone's ever like taken silly putty, like got a whole bunch of it, and shoved up some of their ass, and they try to pull it out, and you know, it stretches, and they can't get it out. Mm -hmm. And then they got silly putty stuck up their ass. Oof. Now it's not very, uh, it's kind of sticky. I can't imagine, uh, oh, Bacon Man. Bacon Man! <clears throat> For those of you who don't know who Bacon Man is, you should, uh, Facebook him. He has, uh, Instagram. He has some other apps, too. But, uh, he's our local bacon dude here in Indianapolis. Really cool guy. Works his ass off. California now. Mm hmm. To try to. Dude works <clears throat> his ass off, self promoting, works like two jobs, got kids. He's a really solid dude. We met him at a Pacers game one night. Uh, really cool guy. Look up the Bacon Man. 
if you're into uh what's he do dance he yeah. dance he's like a he's like a like an everyday hype man just to fucking build up the energy and fucking get everything going good and positive so he's a really cool guy we love the baker man the kids love the baker man they didn't know what to do when they saw him <laughs> Right. Because <laughs> he walks around in a bacon suit and he's like a cool bacon chain. He had the Pacers jersey on and everything and shit. It was really fucking awesome. We love the Baker Man. Mmm. What are you trying to grab me for? God damn, your hands are cold as shit. Holy fuck. I thought you were hot. I am hot. Because just look at me. Hey. You, you grasping my thick thighs. I got some thick. thicky thick. I got some thicky thick thighs. I think my thighs... They're bigger than yours. The fuck? Oh, no. I think we should measure them. <clears throat> My, oh, yeah. Yours is muscles. Mine's fat. No, yours ain't fat. Look. Yours ain't fat. <laughs> That's complete fat. No, it's not. It's a fucking... Uh, it's complete deliciousness. Why don't you bend over and bite your thighs? No, no, no. What? That's what I do. <clears throat> Miss Mattel doesn't know what to do when she's like... Great to change at night. I can like, bite her bare ass. She's like... No! You gotta get a mouthful of ass. <laughs> I don't do well with butt things. <laughs> what? Well, I don't. I ain't trying to eat her ass. I'm just trying to bite her butt cheek. <laughs> Buttholes. Butt things. No butthole. I want a butthole. <clears throat> I just want a butt cheek. <laughs> what? How's that cool 45? Amazing. You done? You're done? Yeah. Oh my god, I don't know sign language. Yes, I'm done. Oh, I got, I see a thumb up. I see, like, maybe you're doing a shocker. You want two in the pink, one in the stink. I can't do that with my fingers. You want a shocker? I can't. I can't pull, do that. Pull your ring finger down. Your I finger. can't do that. Right? You're just doing it right now. Oh. You're doing it right now. I didn't do it. Sometimes, Mr. McStud, you're like, you're doing it. You're doing fine. Just keep doing it. Like, right then, I can't. Like, you can do it. <laughs> what was that, uh, was that the water? What? You can do it. You, no, I'm not done drinking my beer. Oh. I'm almost done. You ready for work this week, baby? Mm, are you ready for work this week? I wish I could work. I work entirely too much. So, hell no, I ain't ready. Oof. Yeah. I wish I could do something. Something. I have no something. idea how many hours I work. Too fucking many. I lost count yeah. a long time ago. Too fucking many. <laughs> I really Ugh. don't. Yeah, too fucking many hours. <clears throat> it's goddamn ridiculous. Might be able to calculate. Well, you can't do the shocker. How are you going to count your fingers? I can't. No? Too many. 48 in my first job. I worked 5, 10, 15, 21 in my second job last week. I don't know, I remember you had like extra hours and then another two hours from being called at home you were trying to get on your first job. <laughs> uh, it was a lot. I worked 95 hours, 97 hours technically, with my first job in two weeks. <sighs> and then in two weeks I worked about 20... <clears throat> 23 hours, both jobs at my second job. That's why I love this woman, she's like... <laughs> Tell me, like, shut the fuck up, stop doing what you're doing, fucking sit down, relax. Because I, I, I need you, she's stuff, like, I, I need you not to be disabled, essentially, mm -hmm. is what she tells me. Mm -hmm. And I feel bad. I'm like, I know this, but I still want to help. <laughs> I did come home and have to help you one night, too. Yeah. Because you're. I, I, I wasn't feeling the best. Oh, yeah, you're like, right. I've just been tired. I don't know why. Um, but we do have a, uh, a delicious croissant crust three meat this one of pizza for dinner. Mm, that sounds good. Mm. I don't know if she ate. Yeah, I know. I was supposed to eat that last night, right? Mm hmm I didn't get to eat dinner. No, you were too tired. I ate one slice of you. breakfast pizza and what, what did I eat when I got home? I got you a bacon double cheeseburger from Burger oh. King. Oh, yeah, because I was like, man, I don't want anything here. And, I don't want to. And then we bought the mozzarella sticks from Burger King, and those were like <clears> the most <throat> disgusting fucking things I've ever had in my life. They weren't juicy, they were dry, they were... I was like, no wonder. Disgusting. Mozzarella sticks are always so expensive. Mm -hmm. Burger King, you can buy four of them for like a dollar or something. 
We got and eight. then we got eight of them, and it was like two something. Because I was like, we can split them. It was like two fifty eight or some mm -hmm. something stupid. It's like, why the fuck is their mozzarella sticks so cheap? Oh, there's a reason. Yeah. They suck like a bag of I will never eat them again. Now they're chicken nuggets, and you know they're. Burgers. But your daughter tore them up. I don't know why. Your oldest. Well, that's why she's like never had them because your daughter didn't want them, and then my two were like, yeah, we'll try them. I was like, they're pretty disgusting, and there's marinara sauce. Like, be careful because it's open in there. I didn't realize she ate them. She ate every one of them. She's like, I'm tearing them up. Are you serious? I was like, those things are fucking nasty. Those are the fucking worst mozzarella sticks. And she's like, oh, no. And I'm like. Those are the worst mozzarella sticks. They I've taste like, what did I say? Oh, they taste like the. The chicken fry breading. Chicken fry breading with a very little cheese. And it wasn't stringy or anything. It was very either. dry and disgusting. I love the mozzarella mm. sticks from Arby's. They're just super expensive. They have, yeah, they have really good mozzarella sticks. Oh, I swear. I think I might try to get Vito's this week. Okay. Don't ask me when. Is that from our gift card? Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. I forgot we still got the gift card. That sounds delicious. Thursday be the day because it's a half uh, buy one, get one boneless. So you can get like a snack size and you get a free <laughs> snack size. How am I supposed to eat two snack sizes? Well, we'll both get them and get double and I'll eat the rest. What you don't eat? Wait a minute, did you want to go there and eat them? Well, I don't see that happening, but no. Yeah, I was going to bring you, have you pick them up for lunch. Oh, okay. I can do that. Can you buy me a beer to go? <laughs> Wouldn't be my first go around with a beer to go at a bar. <laughs> you could be like that by customers. Well, the thing with like, you can't really. <laughs> poor, poor loco. <laughs> you, can't, you, you can't really do that at B-dubs. Like the bar we were at when I got my beer to go was you just walk out the back door like you're going to drink on the patio <laughs> and you just take it to go. That was many years ago and that was stupid and I don't recommend anyone do that. that but I want a beer to go so, you can, so I can drink it at work. <sighs> I can actually bring you one mm. and we can put it in a styrofoam cup yeah. and you can like idea. it looks like a like a ginger ale when i you... drank that bitch before anybody even questioned it <laughs> <laughs> anyways <laughs> happy moliker sunday we'll catch you guys tomorrow for moliker monday uh if i'm still alive and functioning after tomorrow because tomorrow's gonna be a crazy day Damn, oh you just pinched me i want to make sure why you were talking stupid Oh, not like that. You love me. I do. You fucking fool. I got a grasp on this can. Mm, like your dick, and it ain't going nowhere. That sounds fucking hot. You understand that? Oh, I don't I, want. I, will you reiterate to me later? <laughs> yes. All right. <laughs> Anyways, I'm excited. I'm just so excited. <laughs> catch you bitches tomorrow. <laughs> this is. Mm.